I'm Nathaniel and I'm presenting Pick and Mix Information Operators for Probabilistic ODE Solvers. Let's start with a motivational example. The Kepler model describes the movement of a planet around a star and the model itself is given by a second order ordinary differential equation. But when you numerically simulate this model, you typically transform it first to a first order ODE and then plug it into your favorite um, numerical simulator. In our paper, we consider probabilistic numerical ODE servers and we show how those servers can be conveniently used to solve second order ODEs directly. Now in this example, we have additional information available, not just the ordinary differential equation itself, but we know that the true solution satisfies conservation laws for energy and angular momentum. And again, here the probabilistic numerical framework allows us to conveniently include this additional information into the solver in order to get more accurate numerical simulations. In a nutshell, probabilistic ODE solvers um, approximate a posterior distribution over the true solution, conditioned on the fact um, that the ODE has to be satisfied on a discrete set of points. And in this work, we took a closer look at the information that is conditioned on, and we generalize it to a more broader class of information operators, which allows us to model not just um, first order ODEs, but in the same information operator language, we can also describe second order ODEs, um, even differential algebraic equations, or additional types of information. And as a result, um, Depending on the specific problem you have at hand, you can pick and mix information operators from these class of information operators um, to build your own custom ODE solver. The inference itself is done with extended common filtering and smoothing, um, very similarly to what we do in probabilistic ODE servers for first order ODEs. Our results include more efficient solvers for second order ODEs, um, we show improved stability for long-term simulations by keeping energy levels constant. We observed that uh, samples are more structured and we present the first probabilistic numerical solvers for differential algebraic equations. If you want to hear more, please come by our poster on Tuesday, um, have a look at our paper currently on archive or the experiment code that you can find on GitHub. And if you got curious about probabilistic ODE solvers in general, we have software libraries available in Julia, propnumdefect.jl, or um, in Python uh, with propnum, a package not just for probabilistic numerics for ODEs, but probabilistic numerics for many numerical problems. Thank you.